So welcome to this preview of the Pop Culture Challenge Tier 1 final. Hi, I'm Jack Lewis. I'm Lewis Jones. I'm Tom. I'm uh, old. I'm Tom Speller. If you had one piece of advice for somebody who was looking at Mimir mm. thinking, this is a brutal format that I'm absolutely rubbish at. Um, if you had one piece of advice for them to either play the game better or get better at the game, um, what would it be, um, Jack? I think just don't get disheartened if you get something wrong. You know, I think where a question wrong is an opportunity to learn something, I think. And, you know, it's there's very few hobbies that you can do where you're playing your first, it could be your first ever game and you're against the best in the world, like literally. You know, if you turn up to a tennis tournament and you're playing Novak Djokovic, you're going to get beaten. <laughs> so I think when you have these sort of tournaments and you're playing against, especially online stuff now, the absolute best in the world who are, in a lot of cases, professionals, um, I think it can be disheartening to sort of lose, but I think it's, it's, it's something you've got to take and sort of get better at, really, I think. Okay. Um, Lewis? Uh, from a tactical standpoint, uh, the quick pass is always your friend. Uh, I really think there's a lot of, you know, you think about during the question, if you don't know and you think the other people don't know, quick pass, because you're giving them that extra time. And there's so many, especially when I'm reading, I see people taking too much time. And I think that, you know, it could really, it can really, it can really change the game if you don't give people that time. And more importantly, yeah, just enjoy it. I think there is no more important piece of advice than to enjoy it. Um, don't get stressed about it and just have a good time. It's a game. It's fun. Mm. And the people make it and we play, you know, we play with great people week in, week out. So enjoy it. Tom Adams. Um, so what I would say, like in the, fir the first season we played, I, there were sometimes I didn't guess on my own questions, even though I, I had a reasonable idea because I thought it would sound stupid, <laughs> which is about the worst approach to this that you can possibly have. Um, I tried to play it very, very tight. I mm. very rarely guess. Um, mm. And... Either. So and that's a really important thing to do is to understand sort of how when you're semi sure about something, be realistic about whether it really is just a punt. Mm. Um, and in the early round, especially, there's nothing more disheartening than watching bonuses that you know go past you because mm. you've had a ridiculous guess. Or, for example, had your audio break out and you only hear the words Jimmy Nail, for, <laughs> <laughs> for example, and just say, oh, Spender, must be. <laughs> no, bad, bad tactics, don't do that. Um, that. That's, I think, the main thing, is just not spewing away bonus attempts. I think I think the, your, your first comment about, you know, always make sure you guess when it's your question is a really good one mm. because I think new quizzes think everybody is looking at them, pointing the finger at laughing. Yeah, what actually is happening? People are thinking, "Oh, thank God, I might have a shot of this." They're not thinking mm. about no what you've just said. They're just thinking mm. about how the game's playing. They're not mocking you. They're just they're, they're just thinking, "I might get a shot of the bonus here," and then and then they forgot about it when the next question comes up. So I think that's really good advice. Have a guess, even if it's stupid. Have a guess. And uh, finally, Tom Speller. I think overall, um, any question can come up. So. You've got going with the mindset that um, you know, you'll get a quad or get a day that goes your way. So I think, as others have said, don't get disheartened if you get a few rough ones early on or you, or you have a rough mm -hmm. quiz. You know, your day will come. I think for the more serious player and just building on the point about uh, always going for your own questions, I completely agree with that. On bonuses, I, I think it's, it's knowing when to swing and when to leave. And that can be a really hard skill to master over time. But I think in the first instance, it's um, yeah. If your instinct is telling you you you're pretty sure, it's better to go for it than not. Hmm. Great advice, guys. Um, thank you so much for coming and talking to us. Um, the big day will fast approach, and you'll be facing off against one another. Um, all we can ever hope is that when it comes to it, you do yourself justice. You get some lots of great answers, and it's a nice, um, tight, fair interesting battle and the person who ends up winning is the person who who played the best on the night so mm -hmm. best of luck to all of you um you can't all win but hopefully you can all come out of it with your heads held high at the end of it so best of luck and thank you very awesome. much thank you gareth thank, thank you, gareth. you gareth. good luck everyone good luck yeah best, luck, Cheers. best of luck okay and i will